getting on for 50% of the cases in the UK are currently with people in the education environment. The key thing was when we saw the disease was spread by people who were asymptomatic, didn't have any symptoms of the disease, far more so than actually once you had symptoms. And that provided the clear need to test the well and test the well every day. Individual testing is done using these nasal swabs which are really unpleasant to use. Uh, with co-test we're getting rid of that, we're using saliva swabs that go in the mouth, absorb some saliva and then samples from a whole group, a whole class can go into the machine at the same time to detect whether anyone in that group has COVID. And doing it this way enables you to test frequently every day if needed across the whole school to screen everyone for the disease. From the saliva swab samples, CoTest runs a rapid RNA amplification test to detect whether one or more um, of the samples has COVID. As the vaccine rolls out in 2021 and the infection rates reduce, I mean that pooling the samples together becomes ever more efficient in terms of screening large numbers of people more frequently. CoTest improves on existing pooling strategies by extracting the RNA from the entire sample. Uh, and that means the assay at the end can be a lot more sensitive um, and pick up the individual cases within, within the sample more readily. We're developing co-test internally at TTP at the moment, but we're seeking funding partnerships so we can dramatically accelerate the development um, and get this machine out there and in use.